Uh, good day. Uh, today is uh, Thursday, December the 8th, and it is the 84th day of the nationwide uprising in Iran. This morning, uh, the regime executed the first detained protester, 23-year-old Mohsen Shekari. He was charged with Muharrabe or waging war on God. The regime's Mizan news agency reported the execution this morning. Dozens of detained protesters uh, face charges or have been convicted of charges that carry out death penalty according to the regime's so-called uh, justice system. Activists are warning that others could also be put on death as at least a dozen people so far have received death sentences over their involvement in the demonstrations. Reactions to the inhumane execution were fast and furious. Uh, protested uh, today chanted for every person who is killed, a thousand will uh, rise up. Many social media posts said the regime had chosen how people should respond. Uh, we told you not to execute. You did not listen. Now we say we will take revenge, protesters wrote in the social media as they vowed revenge for uh, Shekhari and all those who were innocently killed uh, on the streets. A number of activists in Iran, including in Tehran and Karaj, belonging to the MEK-affiliated resistance units, told international media outlets that execution of Shekari will only strengthen the uprising. Protesters gathered in various cities, including in Satar Khan district of Tehran, and shouted, death to Khamenei. Uh, Shekari, was, uh, Shekari was arrested in this district. The people of uh, Punak district in Tehran also staged a night protest and chanted, death to the dictator, death to Khamenei. Protesters also installed a big banner of uh, Mohsen Shekari's revenge on the major Hemmat Highway in Tehran. And this evening, protesters in Neka, which is in Mazandaran province, set ablaze the regime's public prosecutor's office there. In another aspect of the ongoing protest, store owners in at least 80 cities were on a strike, and dozens of universities and schools across the country saw their students boycotting the classes. People throughout Iran were involved in an uh, expansive three-day campaign that included anti-regime protests, rallies, uh, gatherings, demonstrations, and marches. On this morning, uh, store owners in cities of Sanandaj in Kurdistan province, Ravansar in Kermanshah province, and Najafabad in Isfahan province took to the streets, uh, protesting decisions by authorities to shutter uh, stores of those who participated in the recent three-day strikes in solidarity with the ongoing Iranian revolution. And this was the news for today, Thursday, December the 8th, and thanks for watching.